Hi folks, Scott Sager with you here again. Today I've got Ben Dalton here with me. Ben is the president of the Kiwanis Club here in Fulton County in Rochester. So I uh, wanted to bring him in because we've got the big dinner coming up. So uh, he's going to tell us a little bit about it, a little bit about the history of this big dinner on Monday night. Welcome. Thanks, Scott. Good to have you here. Uh, for, the, here. for those of you that don't know, Ben is a mortgage officer with First Federal Savings Bank here in Rochester. Mm -hmm. How long have you been there? Just celebrated my 23rd year. Wow. April 24th. We are not old enough to be working anywhere 23 uh, years, are we? We were just talking about that. We're <laughs> 18. Right? We are. We're like 18. <laughs> In our minds. Yeah. Well, exactly. uh, you stepped up. You've been a member of the Kiwanis for a number of years, and this year mm -hmm. you're president of the group. They finally convinced me to run, and <laughs> I said yes. Excellent. Excellent. Well, um, every year, folks, <clears throat> it's a tradition. Uh, they're before the primaries and right before the general mm -hmm. election to uh, host a dinner, and a lot of the candidates come to this dinner, but what kind of inspired this uh, chicken noodle dinner on Monday night before the election? Well, I'm not sure the origins of the date beginning uh, the night before the primary and the general election, but uh -huh. it's the slot time slot has worked out really well for us because uh, we have had a nice bump um, <clears throat> with the candidates running. Yeah. Um, it seems like uh, they bring out a nice crowd, and yeah. um, it adds... Uh, it's, you can almost mark your calendar. It's always yeah. the, the Monday before the yep. primary and uh, general election. And um, it's been that way ever since I've been there. And, yeah. you know, this is our 35th year for the wow. chicken noodle dinner. And That's great. Uh, last year was our 60th year, or actually this upcoming year uh, will be the 60th year for, for the turkey. Ones? Oh, wow. Dinner. For the turkey dinner. Mm -hmm. Wow. Well, it's a great opportunity for folks to meet the candidates if they haven't already or mm -hmm. to learn more about them. I'm sure you've learned everything you needed to know from watching uh, my interviews here, but uh, it kind of fills in the blanks. It's a good opportunity for folks to kind of come together. Yeah. Now, the thing that has always amazed me is that we take folks from the community and we put them into a kitchen setting. And I've worked volume restaurants for years, and I will tell you, we kick out a lot of meals during that time yeah it's uh what are some easy. of the numbers that of how many meals served? oh they're uh upper eight nine hundred wow. um it the fall meal seems to be a little bit bigger sure as far as volume is concerned but um that's great yeah, it's it's amazing that's a it's great a, numbers and in a very short amount of time now let's talk about this this is monday may 7th at rochester high school cafeteria from five to seven five to seven mm -hmm. p.m you can come in. Uh, lot, Eldon Umbarger has been out there selling everybody a ticket. But he's a rock star. He is a rock star. Sales, man. We have to give him a shout out because yes. every uh, every dinner we have, he's yeah. by far and away our leading salesman. So he is. Uh, Eldon, thank you again. <laughs> Eldon's a great guy. I apologize, Eldon. I didn't get back with you. I will not be able to uh, come to the dinner on Monday, <laughs> but uh, he's called a couple of times. But uh, does great work, and the Kiwanas do great work in this community. Uh, you meet every Wednesday, right? Every Wednesday at lunch, uh, we meet at the hospital in the um, boardroom. Okay, upstairs, upstairs. In mm -hmm. the new wing. And, and you have a nice uh, lunch there, and typically a presenter there. Lunch is provided uh, at cost, of course. Mm -hmm. But, um, yeah, each uh, member takes a month and <clears throat> is in charge of getting... Um, Talent or somebody new to come in? Entertainment. Yeah, entertainment. A, a program, <laughs> we call them. But yeah. So lots of nice programs. I've been in some mm -hmm. of those meetings and seen, uh, well, I remember one of the Pottawatomie Park up there on mm -hmm. uh, 331. You had them come in. I learned so yeah. much just from that presentation. So you're doing great things there. The Kiwanas, uh, principally, you guys invest funds that, that you collect to scholarships, correct? Correct. And you've been giving out scholarships throughout your existence as an organization, I believe. Yeah, for as long as I mm -hmm. have been there and probably before then. Um, our two main fundraisers, the chicken noodle dinner coming up mm -hmm. Monday, uh, the 7th, and then the turkey dinner <clears throat> in the fall, both are our two big fundraising um, initiatives that help fund uh, scholarships to seniors we That's have great. here in Rochester and at Caston. So. Yeah. Um, and Kiwanis is all about children anyway. We also support Riley um, Hospital, and um, we've been doing that. Like I said, this is our 60th. Uh, this year will be our 60th dinner, turkey dinner, and the 35th coming up uh, on Monday for the chicken noodle. I can't believe it's that many, but right. I haven't been to all of them, but uh, <clears throat> Bob Peterson has been. <laughs> of course he our, has. Um, he's, he's been a lifetime member uh -huh. uh, pretty much, and we gave him... 
uh, his 60 year pin just recently. And um, That's great. he's been a guiding force for the Absolutely. Kiwanis. He's been a guiding force mm -hmm. in this community for many years. So kudos exactly. to Bob as well as to Eldon and the other members of the Kiwanis. Now we can get carry out, can't we? Carry out. Okay, carry out's available. Exactly. So we just show up mm -hmm. and there's a whole line mm -hmm. um, just serving the carry out. So you can take the dinners home with you. Dine in or carry out. <clears throat> and there's a line for each. Uh, tickets still available. They're $8. $8. Excellent. And um, yeah, we'd love to, if you're not doing anything Monday, weather's cooperating. It's getting a little warmer. So come on out if you have, uh, have some time to yeah. sit down and... Well, yeah, it, it's a great meal. It really is. And I want to give a shout out also to the Rochester schools. Um, they give us a lot of help as, as the Kiwaners are back there cooking and kind of guiding us in their kitchen as the way things it's need to be It's a very long day for the kitchen staff, but they are very um, gracious and um, we can't thank them enough right. for their support because without them... It, you know, we would struggle. It'd for be me and you over a barrel with some fire down in there <laughs> trying to cook up 800 meals. It would be a lot more labor, <laughs> laborsome. It would be. It would be. Well, a lot of good people doing a lot of good things here in Fulton County. The Kiwanas, Ben Dalton, and all the folks there doing great work. I want to encourage everybody to get out. Again, it's Monday evening from 5 to 7. $8 will buy you a wonderful meal. And if you dine in, you actually get refills, right? You can have more stuffing or yeah, dressing. Pretty much all you can eat. Excellent. So, Excellent. Um, if you're looking for some comfort food, come on out Monday night. We'll, we'll hook you up. It is. Very good. Well, thank you again for being here, Ben. Thank you for tuning in and watching. And I want to encourage everybody to get out on Monday night and uh, go to the Kiwanis Dinner at Rochester High School from 5 to 7. Thanks again. Thank you.